Hi, allergy shots or allergy immunotherapy is a way to treat uh, underlying allergies to uh, environmental allergies like uh, trees, grasses, weeds, ragweed, moles, dust mites, cats, and dogs. Uh, it's been in use for more than 100 years. They work great. They're more than 90% effective, especially when it comes to pollen and animal allergens. They're still also effective about 75 to 80% when it comes to dust mites and molds. Uh, treatment regimens you really start off at very low doses uh, with small injections given in the upper arm um, of the different allergens. Um, those are done on a weekly or twice weekly basis for the first uh, couple of months. Then we go down to once a week for about a year, year and a half. We expect to see full effect and benefit from those shots within that time frame. However, we generally do not recommend stopping them at that time as there is a high chance of the symptoms coming back as soon as those shots are stopped. So generally after a year and a half, we go down to twice a month for about two years, then once a month for uh, about a year or so, and then discontinue those shots with success rates of more than 90-95%, even 10 years after stopping those shots. Um, allergy shots are uh, extremely safe. Uh, they've been in use for 100 years or more now. Uh, um, the only uh, potential risk from the shot is a reaction, and, there, and that's why uh, it's generally recommended that um, to receive those shots, you have to be in a medical facility in case there is a need for a treatment of an allergic reaction. So in our patients, we generally have them stay about 15 to 20 minutes after they receive their injection, um, after which they leave. Um, just to make sure, again, there is no um, uh, reaction. Um, we do give them from, for patients age five years and above, um, and we do give them through pregnancy uh, with no adverse events um, as the standard recommendation is to continue those shots during pregnancy. But of course, we do not increase the dose of those injections because we do not want to risk the uh, potential of having an allergic reaction that we need to treat when a person is pregnant. Um, it's uh, of note, uh, please note, uh, many times uh, people refer to once a season shot as an allergy shot. That is a corticosteroid shot. Uh, those, although can work effectively, uh, they do carry the potential for long-term uh, risks, including the risks for uh, osteoporosis, cataracts, glaucoma, among others. Um, um, most patients still need to take their allergy medicines for the first year, year and a half. However, after about... Um, two years or so, we start looking forward to tapering off some of these medications. Uh, among the main indications for uh, using allergy injections uh, are patients who do not have adequate control with the medications or patients who do not want to stay on medicines that only treat symptoms for many years and would like to take care of their allergies. Uh, but among the most uh, important one is anybody who has what we describe as allergic asthma. So anybody with asthma that generally flares up during spring and fall especially uh, is a candidate for such treatment um, as those shots can be very effective in alleviating the symptoms of asthma as well. Uh, um, further, another indication is uh, somebody who has recurrent sinus problems um, that require multiple treatment with antibiotics over the year. Controlling those allergies with allergy immunotherapy uh, can have significant impact in reducing the frequency of such infections. And if, you know, um, if any questions remain, uh, please feel free to visit our website to find additional information or feel free, feel free to call, call us at any time. Thank you.